Hey, my friends, you're listening to The Tony Gephardt Show. And for today's bonus content, you know, if you're anything like me, especially if you walk in the shoes of someone with a disability, independence is important. And some of us may be in that transition of feeling afraid of taking that first step of finding independence. What does independence mean? And still in that odd transition stage of codependency into independence. And today's kind of a kind of a venting episode. You know, I want to go out. I really want to go in, into this with like true empathy for my brothers and sisters and family that are out there that struggle with their independence, maybe because there's an interference with that independence. Because there's two sides. There's those of us that are wanting to be independent, and then there's another side that doesn't know how to just yet. And let me just first say, thanks so much for subscribing to the YouTube channel, youtube.com slash MRJT1020. We just hit 2,200 subscribers, and we were at 1,000 in October. So just this immense flux of support has been incredible. And if you're listening on Spotify or Apple Podcasts, reviews are everything for the exposure and expansion of the podcast. So please leave those five-star reviews down there if you like what you hear and share the podcast with a friend. So let's just start off with this. Those of us who are blind or visually impaired, you know, the last thing we want in so many cases, from my experience, I don't like being touched. I don't like being grabbed. I don't like my personal space being invaded while I am navigating in transit, whether that be through public store, maybe I'm at the bank, the airport, uh, or I'm just wa- taking a stroll down the street, um, with, especially with my dog. And a lot of the time, What ends up happening is a good Samaritan wishes to assist because they see a situation where the other person may be in distress or maybe not doing the task the way they envision it to be done. And this causes this causes this 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 drastic change of events to happen where the individual wants to help and maybe they maybe they help in a way that without realizing they're not helping they're infringing and I think sometimes we have to take a moment to identify am I really helping the situation or do I want to look good and yes I'm going to tap into the controversial and say that Instead of helping without asking, ask before helping. It Now, the argument I'll say is, well, you know, what if they get hit by a car? You know, what if you get hit by a car? Everyone is at risk in life. We have to be careful how much we are trying to overtake someone's true freedom and autonomy. That's important. Autonomy is important here. There's a fine line. And this could be an hours long podcast, mind you. Today's just a bonus content. So I really just wanted to throw out some some philosophy and some thoughts on independence versus codependence and what all of that might entail. So overall, I just want to say thank you again for all the support in the podcast. I hope you're doing well. Know that you are loved and that you matter. And we will see you guys in the next episode.